Right now, I'm headed to get Kayla, and today is girls' day out. Kayla and I are fixing to have an absolute ball today, so sit back and enjoy. Okay, let me set the platform for you. Darren Knight and Red Squirrel, their own social media, they are both comedians here in Alabama. They are well-known comedians. Um, Darren has over 3 million followers and Red Squirrel has almost 700,000 followers. Um, they're hilarious, the funniest people in the world. Well, Darren is also a chicken person, okay? He has a farm. Well, he posted that he was looking for peahens. And so my follower followers started tagging me in his post. Well, it caused him to reach out to me about the peahens. And if you remember, it was a live. And he said, hey, it's Darren Knight. Well, at first I thought it was him. Then I started thinking it was a scammer. <laughs> it was really him. So I, I reached out to him, I got his phone number, and he is going to be rescuing a couple of peahens um, from the lady that called me about rescuing all those peacocks. So he's going to be getting a couple of peahens. Well, he invited Kayla and I over for lunch today. So we're headed to his house. He has a plantation. I cannot wait to see his farm and meet both of them. So again, I'm headed to get Kayla and then we're off. It's an hour and a half drive one way. Who greeted us as soon as we got here? I can't remember her name. Is she gonna come up to you and not? I was like, is she gonna come up to you without me? Come on, come see me. Can I love you? Can I love you? You think I got something? We're at the grocery store, getting getting prepared for lunch. Having creamy chicken Cajun oh, Alfredo. Uh, not today. Not this. Here's that. You better get you some. Betty, you better. Oh, them grapes are fine. I know. That's what I was thinking. Oh, we might have to hang on them. Ain't on ourselves, baby. <laughs> All right, I got you some. Um, here's Is she scared of me? Grapes. No. Oh, okay. You so better eat your lunch. Sometimes. Here's you a sweet tater and everything, baby. Hey, you coming to see us? You're beautiful. You're so beautiful. So pretty. I oh wonder what her name, God. his name, not her. I don't know. I don't think we're supposed to call him beautiful. Oh, you handsome. handsome. You're so handsome. Hey. Hey. Hey, pretty boy. You look cute. Cutie. Huh? Yes, you are. Hey. Hey. Do you want to come see me? You're a pretty baby. Yes, you are. You're a pretty baby. Can you talk to me? Can you come talk? On. There you go. Talk to me. Talk to me. This bird is so friendly. Oh. Hey, baby. I need you in my life. There you go, pretty baby. Oh. oh, don't get my finger.
Hey. Look at him. Look at him cooking up a nice lunch right there for That's all of right. us. That's right. That's what I'm talking about. Lunch ever. We're spalt rotten. Uh -huh. I found a friend. Look how cute so they are. Okay. Hey, this is Woodstock. <laughs> and I just love that no. name. And they rehomed that dog. Oh my God, that's. <laughs> that is so funny. I love it. Oh my gosh, that made me laugh. Look at Miss Betty over there. I would just love. I, I dream of having like land like this where my animals just walk all around, even including like up to my house. Yeah. Would that not be so much fun? So fun. Oh, oh. Here is where? I don't see them. Oh, they're phantoms. They're, oh my gosh, those are ceramas, I think. Oh, you get ugly. Oh. You a good girl. She, she's gonna be jealous. Yes, she is. When she finds out I've been loving on Betty White, she gonna be jealous. <laughs> Do you like your belly rub? Like, like your belly rub? Will you clap? Oh, she's getting, she's getting, she's getting weak. <laughs> oh, Betty, why? I got your love spots. We're friends now. We're You're friends. in there now. Y'all besties. I am friends with Betty White. I knew how to get her love spot. Yeah, he's out of here. You want me to scratch right here? She, she's going to be so jealous. <laughs> yes, she is. You're gonna be so jealous. Oh, they're just Such pretty. Oh, there's more sheep over here. Yeah, and they're look like some babies. Oh my goodness. I love babies. Oh, those are goats. Oh no, the sheep. The sheep are with mama. Look how cute. the buck since Bobby Joe left. I know. Is that a, that, oh, that's a female. Female. Two yeah. bucks. Y'all pretty babies. Yes, you are. Yeah, you're gorgeous. Shake your tail feathers. You shake them for Betty White over there. Oh my goodness. Here, Betty White. You want to come be my, my friend? I feel bad that we're out here playing and he's out there cooking for us. I know, me too. I like all the picnic tables out here too. Okay, we might get attacked. Oh. Kayla, I'm getting it on film. If you get attacked, we're getting this on film. Because oh. we can make $100,000 off the funniest home videos of you running... From, the geese. from these geese attacking you. <laughs> oh, it's so pretty out here. It is gorgeous. That water don't look like it's very deep. Nope. They look like they're ready to attack you, Kayla. Going up there. Go closer. Go closer. <laughs> oh no, they're running from me. They don't want to be my friend. Oh, poor Kayla. Oh, you're going to get attacked. If you attack me, I have the camera and we can't get it on camera. Oh, they're so pretty. There's two white peacocks. Yeah. Put one in your stick one in your pocket. <gasps> Look how beautiful. So you see two. Oh, there is. Wait, is that a female or a male? I think it's another male. Oh my goodness. He don't need two. We need one of them. We need one. It's 
Disney's farmhouse. We'll tell them we'll trade them a pen for a white peacock. Oh my goodness. They're Are they going to go in the water? I don't know. I think they're running away from us. They're oh. just trying to be away from they're us. Like, Get away. Oh, he's in the water. Oh, oh they're so beautiful. Hey. I put it. You know what I should have done? I should have stayed in here and watched. Hey, we're good now. Ooh, we going to oh. have some good food. Here comes the good part. Oh. That looks so delicious. Oh, yeah. Bada, 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 good, bada, good. Okay. Oh, oh they're fast. Oh, they're so cute. Where did it go? There it is. It's behind that. <laughs> the white peacock is all fanned out so I'm going to try to go and get closer to see what it looks like up close because I've never seen a white peacock in person oh isn't he pretty oh my gosh I'm going to try to get a picture I'm going to try to go closer that was nothing like I expected me neither but it was so much better than I expected I mean, he was just so laid back and chill and like, I felt like I had known him forever. I know, he was so easy to talk to and just get like right along with. And like, you know, like when we went in there and he was like, the house is a wreck, blah, 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 you know, and like, I, I just loved that. I did too, I really did. I, I just, it made me feel like I was at home and yes. I had known him forever. Yep, me too. And his house is awesome. And his animals, uh, uh, the pig was my favorite. Oh my gosh, Betty White's my favorite. I figured the peacock was your favorite. Oh, well, no, I do love them pe white peacocks. I know. I'm in love with the white peacocks. We gotta have, we gotta have at least one. Yes, but Betty White, the pig, was definitely my favorite. Yeah. But you know what? I'm leaving there with the ideas in my head, and I'm like, now I'm gonna go home and tell Shane that I want to fence the entire property so I can just let the animals free range. Yes. Can you imagine walking off your front porch and there's Dexter? No, I could never imagine. That, that would, would be. be awesome. But you know what? I'm wondering if I did that, if if I would have grass because they could go it. anywhere on 17 acres. That's right. But I don't want to. I worry about the coyotes. Yeah, the coyotes. So I gotta idea. like. I don't know. They can't be able to go to the creek. But yeah. Anyway, I enjoyed myself and I'm glad that we got to do this together. I'm glad that we went. Did you enjoy getting away from home for just I a minute? Did. I did. I absolutely did. Me too. Do you know what I find the coolest thing is what he talked about doing before he became a comedian? Yes. Where he came from and how he used to just sell cars and be just a... And he worked... Did he say he worked in a warehouse? Uh-huh. Warehouse. Assembly lines and restaurants and in retail and all kind of stuff. He said he just worked odd jobs like here and there and everywhere. And and it seemed like I didn't ask this but it seemed like his fame came from social media. Yeah, because he's absolutely. talking about his videos going viral. Mm -hmm. And, right. and t what was that 2017 he said? Yeah, 2017. And he got a million followers in 2017. Yeah. And here he is today with 3. Point, something. 3.3 or 3.5 million followers. Yeah. Like, you know, just being himself. Yeah. And you know, that that's what I feel like makes people, when you don't try, when you're, when you're just yourself. You're authentically you. Yes. Whether the camera's on or not. Because you can be you all the time. And you, you know, when you pretend to be somebody that you're not. Yeah. Or I think that's where people get in trouble. But he is, he's the same in person as he is on stage, I can tell. He absolutely is. Yeah. I really like, I really like the whole experience. He's awesome. Me too. So I got home from Darren Knight's house and I came to check on the animals and there's a big change in Shishi. Okay, Sunday night, about six o'clock. She's up eating snacks. And I'm in here checking on her. And you check the gate. You know what worries me a little bit is I feel like she's going soon, but what if it's another week or two and then I have her stuck in this stall and she didn't go. 
Here's her little feed bowl. I gave her some treats. But this is what she's looking like. She looks really swollen, like right here. But look at all this milk. Look at all that milk. You see all that? You see all that milk? Let's see if I can get over here. Okay. Her milk. Look, look at her teats. You see how pronounced they are? Y'all, we're so close. She, she, you gonna be a mommy. I'm gonna clean up the stall a little bit from her being in here all day. But you can see, you see how pronounced her teats, teats are? Um, so this is countdown. So now I'm gonna sneak over here by this baby and see if she, She's getting up. I was gonna see if she'd let me lay by her. It takes time for a baby calf to trust you. Like it took Cinco a little bit of time. Like when they're newborns, you can put your hands all over them. But when they start getting of age, and she was a week old Friday, She's like, not sure about this. Let me check with mom. And mom's over there mooing. But maybe next time. So I thought I would update you on Rhino. Rhino! <laughs> see if I can get him to talk. Let's see. He's eating his supper. Rhino! Hey, buddy! You gonna talk to me? You gonna talk to me? Rhino! He's so sweet. I had to put him in here because he's trying to breed my alpacas. And the first thing that went through my mind was Arms Family Farm. And I was like, oh my gosh, their donkey killed their alpaca trying to breed it. And I was like, I can't, I can't handle that. So I have got him separated. Look at this. That's, needs, that's redneck and needs to be fixed. But um, he is in here. He is going to be going to my neighbor but they are in the process of putting up a fence for him. And so he's gonna stay with me for a little while. She's been coming over in the afternoons and spending time with him, brushing him, feeding him. And I've been able to take some really good bonding pictures of them, but he will go two doors down from me. So I will be able to hear him yeehaw every day. I was never the one to write up a song for just anyone I, I was always the one to find myself lost in all conversations oh, Cause I've always been told that things will unfold if you keep on waiting But then you came along and proved me all wrong, I was so mistaken Cause you glue all the pieces back together Yeah you, you take all my wrongs and make them better yeah, you, you're making me want to try forever And I feel so free, oh my sweet baby I was never the one to give up the ghost, no, I was so stuck I kept on playing my part, wanted to give up cause nothing was changing but with you it's so clear And now that you're here I see colors in every spectrum Guess I finally learned my lesson Cause you glue all the pieces back together Yeah you, you take all my wrongs and make them better Yeah you, you're making me wanna try forever And I feel so free Oh my sweet baby Myself, and I'm thinking out loud We won't need nothing else For the rest of our time And I know it so well I will always be by your side Cause you glue all the pieces back together 
Yeah, you, you take all my wrongs and make them better Yeah, you, you're making me wanna try forever and 